Hello, viewers. <laughs> this movie you're about to watch is a gospel movie. And I believe that it's going to bless your soul and minister life into your lives. But please, hold on a minute. Kindly subscribe to this channel. Click the notification bell, like and share. Do it now. Do it now, please. If you do that, you have encouraged us. Subscribe, like and share. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Happy watching. To return all glory and adoration unto you. For what you have done for me, my ministry, and my family. Father, I've gotten you a very big mansion and the latest car in town. Father, could you please follow me? Please follow me. My son, you've forgotten so soon that all I need from you is praises. You go back with your, all your gifts and continue to praise me. You continue to praise me. All I require from you is praises. And praises. And praises. All the Lord. Praises. Father. Dear. 
That was the revelation of God. He doesn't need our money or gift. All he needs from us is praises. Just to be praising him always. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Our God is incomparable. And we will continue to give him praise. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, I believe. It's incomparable. He remains our father always. Hallelujah. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. yeah. I'm coming. Okay. He continues to give you praise. Amen. I'll make life miserable for you. Do your worst. 
You will regret this action. Do your worst. You are going to regret this action. I am not even ashamed of yourself. Shaku, you are insane. Me insane? You are mad. You are insane. Me insane? Yes, you are insane. You are retrieve that one. I know. Retrieve that one. Retrieve that one. Give me a look. Give me a look. Give me a look. What do you mean? What do you mean? My, 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 leave me alone. Stop beating your wife. Have I done too much? Is it too bad that I correct my wife? Uh, but, but I mean, this is unfair. This is not fair. This is not fair at all. I Christian can't... knows by beating up his wife like this, but I mean, this is not fair. I can't accept this. I cannot accept this in this house. Auntie. Talk to her. Auntie, please. Auntie, please. I'm sorry. Shall we you raise your hand to beat me? You raise your hand to beat me? Oh my goodness, my god! Auntie, please forgive him. If you so realize his mistakes, I'll come back to apologize to you. Okay. Please. Please. Okay. Okay. Sir. Sir. Oh, I'm sorry. Sir, the document is ready, sir. Okay. Drop it and go. Sir, you, you have to go through the, the document, sir. What did you say? You have to go through the document, sir. I said, drop it and go. But, sir, we have to deliver... Mimi, come on! I'm sorry, sir. Will you leave my office? I'm sorry, sir. She... How are you? Boss... How are you today? What's wrong? I'm actually not fine. That's obvious. Can you tell me about it? Moses, to be candid with you, my problems are much so serious that uh, I find it difficult to continue to think about it alone. Anyway, um, there are ups and downs in life. But when you share it, it's half solved. So, can I hear it? Hey, I have a very hard knot to crack. My life is in danger. My family is in danger. How about danger? Yeah. How? Tell me about it. I don't know what is wrong with our so-called manager. Like, I don't get. I'm fed up. Actually, I've also been noticing him for three. about three to four days now. Wow. He's not been responding well. Whenever I greet him, he just responds anyhow. This is serious. He doesn't concentrate. In fact, he forgets things easily, which is very unusual of him. It's very unusual of him. Okay, please, what can cause all this drama? I can't believe mm. this. I don't really know, but I think he's under a spiritual attack. Attack? Yes. I don't know about that. If not that he's under a spiritual attack, he wouldn't be behaving the way he is now. Now you talk him. I don't know. See, okay, let me continue my work. That is all business. Moses, before I got married, I used to have sexual intercourse with a particular lady in my dream. And each time I have that dream and I woke up, I noticed that I always get wet. <sighs> the dream kept coming even after my wedding. The lady called Herself, Delilah. Delilah? Yes. 
Yes. And um, any time I have fallen with that lady that way in my dream, when I wake up, there's always a serious fight between me and my wife. <sighs> serious one. In fact, you will not believe that this morning I had a serious fight with my wife before I left the house. Shortly before you came in here, I dozed off. And I actually dreamt that I was with that same lady in a restaurant. Catching fun, and then we left the restaurant for one big hotel where we had the original form. As I am talking to you right now, my underwear is completely wet. Honestly. Shiko, this is serious. Um, but but no, no problem. Hmm? I, I see that an end is here. Okay. Um, I think where we need to start from is you going back home right now. And apologize to your wife. You have wronged her, really. But you need to apologize to her. That's the starting point. Moses, you talk that way because you don't know the magnitude of what I have done to my wife. You see, this is a lady that I have beaten several times. I beat her mercilessly. I spit on her. Uh -huh. Sometimes ago, I locked her inside the room and I left for work. I did not release her until the night. Do you think I can just walk into her and say that I am sorry and she will forgive me? <sighs> this is serious. Well, I believe with God all things are possible. <sighs> Why won't I forgive you? He remains my husband. All the challenges um, are just for the main time. To overcome. Devil is a liar. Wow, I'm so happy to hear this from you. I'm so Thank happy. You. Thank you, Auntie. And this is my brother, Brother Shego. Mm. He's a very kind and generous person. Mm. That you do run away from anything that can cause trouble or harm him. Mm. Auntie, even our parents can testify to this. I know. Yes. I know him very well. I know him to be loving, caring, nice, husband. You know, devil is just raising up his ugly head. And I'm very sure we'll knock him down. Amen. 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 How are you? Uh, you're welcome, sir. Welcome, my brother. Yes, sir. Yes. Sweetheart. I'm so sorry. But this friend is in my life. So I'm so sorry. I've realized it. I'm sorry. I love you. See, you are trying to go with them to a lot of women out there. I've already forgiven you. I've forgiven you. Even before you hurt me. I know devil is just waging war over our home, our family. I surely will overcome. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much. That's why I love you. You see, you're a role model to so many women out there. Thank you. Now let me tell you something. It's a secret. Okay. A lot of 
people have walked up to me to say that my wife is such a fantastic woman. <laughs> and I know you are. Some even said, Sir, you're so lucky to have married your wife. Ooh. And I know that I'm a lucky man. Ooh. Thank you very much. <laughs> I love you. I love you, darling. Thank you, lucky man. <laughs> Yeah. Please, I want you to tell me about Mrs. Okoli. What made her go mad? <laughs> Mrs. Okoli was Reverend Julius Okoli's wife. The founder and pastor of God's Voice Ministry. God's Voice Ministry was one of the biggest ministry in this state. But Mrs. Okoli scattered the ministry in just one day. Mrs. Okoli became overwhelmed. With anger and jealousy, she frustrated her husband before the congregation. Mrs. Okoli would not allow any church member to visit her husband. She accused her husband of things the husband did not do. One day, on her way to conference in Abuja, the hang of the love fell on Mrs. Okoli and Mrs. Okoli became mad. The tree of Mrs. Okoli was cut down because it could not bear any fruit. Hmm. Okay. Yes. That means you have to pray for me. Because I don't want to be like Mrs. Ekoli. That disrespected God called upon a husband. Please, Daddy, pray for me. <laughs> Let us pray. We are grateful, oh Lord. We are grateful, oh Lord, for you. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. If you can't finish the matter today, I would like to see you in this When do you want us to come, sir? Come at your convenient time. Will next week Tuesday be okay, sir? Uh, no problem. Uh, uh, that means we'll come next week Tuesday. Okay. Very well, please. Okay. This one. Thank you very much, All sir. Thanks. Yes, sir. Um, yes, sir, please help us to manage this. Don't worry. Salvation is free. Oh, the sir. Lord bless you. Okay. I said, the Lord bless you. Amen. As you are going back, the Lord will go with you. Amen. Amen. I pray for you. Doors of major breakthroughs open for you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Nations will serve your God. Your generations will serve your God. In the name of Jesus Christ. Please sit down, let me call you back. Young lady, who are you? Daddy. I came because of the two women that just left your office. 
Dockers and gifts. Please, Daddy, I don't want you to attend to them, please. They are so funny. But if they offended you in any way, can't you walk up to them and settle with them and kill them? Daddy, with all due respect, I'm not ready to release Shebu. Please, sir, don't attend to their kids, please. You know what? If you don't have anything to discuss with me about your own life, you can. <laughs> Matthew Johnson, stay away from Shebu's issue, or else you will be put to shame. How dare you? Just disrespect me, you come to my office to threaten me. Please take your leave. You think I don't know you? <laughs> you think I don't know that all the signs and miracles you are doing in this church, you got your power from Marina, the goddess of water? <laughs> Matthew Johnson, you better be careful or I bury you alive. Uh, 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 I'm so, so, so sorry, ma. I, I, I didn't mean to to, 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 rude to you. I don't know you are you, you are the woman. Please, uh, I, will, I, I, I will comply. I will do as you, as you said. Please. You better be safe. not to be in a good mood. What is really happening to you? Father, I'm not. An old friend of mine is in a very big problem. I need to help him. He needs my help. What a good Samaritan you are. The lady your friend keeps having fun together with. Is taking a reference of what your friend has done to her. Father, a revenge? Father, I'm confused. Delilah will take the life of your friend in 72 hours. And no one can stop her. <laughs> 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 